factory. We are on our way to an art exhibit. Who would have thunk? On the boardwalk in Bow Harbor, in between the sea and civilization. Here we go. We're backstage. Get ready to go get on the four-wheeler. I like that hair, don't you? It's nice of you to tie your brother's shoe. He's got a safety pit in his head. The hat is from Nigeria. You know what? When we did the DNA test, I had some from Nigeria. The trousers are Levi jeans. And the umbrella is from Britain. Where I guess, oh, this over here. That one's interesting. Hmm. This one is a turban from India. And then armor from the 13th and 15th century. The sweater, 1940 stadium. Then you have a kilt and some shoes. Interesting. How would you like to carry that around? Again, I guess it's called a hat. Oh no, the hat's up on the top. Ah, <laughs> miniature fedora. And then you have a wig from the 1850s. And a cane. An interesting fella, that's all I can say. Hairstyle Medusa. Ah, look at this hairstyle, Seth. Yeah. Yes, that looks more like a clown outfit. Green shoes. The jacket, it's a tuxedo jacket from the 1970s. The suit is from the 19th century. The tie is from the 18th century. St the hair is a ram horn inspired. Uh, mm, this hat looks like a hat from India. Oh, turkey. A fez. The boat shirt is British. The bow tie, 1970s in the United States. What about the bottom part? West African. The skirt. Game is a poker set from the United States. Joker. Joker. Thought red feather wig. The mass, 1920s. The boots, Anglo-American riding boots. Very interesting. Hmm. Hair. Red, magenta, there you go, potential church. And auburn brown streaks from the 1900s to the 1920s. I didn't know that. Shirt and tie is British, 1990s. Right there, you can see that. Jacket. Japanese from the 1920s to 1950s. Pants are vintage baseball pants from the 1930s. And the shoes are vintage 1970 purple shoes. Can't beat that. Stephanie's so interested. Steph's so interested in this stuff, it is blowing her away. Yes. Right, sweets? Yes, it's just amazing. It is amazing. Nigerian born, New York based artist. Aiku Day is a celebrated portrait photographer and stylist, one of the best dressed men in the world, earning a place in Vanity Fair's international best dressed list four times this past decade. And all these pictures that we're going to see or that you have seen, he turns the camera lens on himself. Okay, so he's the artist. Who would have thought here in the Bell Harbor, Bow, Bow I'm sorry, not Bell, Bell Harbor Boardwalk that you would find such art. 
but we found it and we found it for you thanks so much for watching this vlog i'll catch you on the next one give me a thumbs up and uh don't forget to punch the uh the bell because if you punch the bell then every time we upload you will know it catch you on the next one this one is over Thank you.